Hey guys, Jeff with Giga Parts here, W4LKO. I wanted to show you how easy it is to do the firmware update on the IC7610. Uh, of course you're going to have to download the firmware update. Uh, the only other thing you're going to need is a USB flash drive or a SD uh, media card. Uh, we're going to use a SD flash card today. Or, I'm sorry, a USB flash drive, uh, not an SD card. So uh, here, let's jump into it. So you'll want to download the uh, firmware update. Uh, I've got that downloaded already. I'll put a link to that in the video. Uh, while that's downloading, take your uh, USB flash drive, go ahead and plug it into the front of the 7610. Uh, from here, uh, you'll want to format this drive before you copy the firmware to the drive. Uh, so we're going to go to menu, set, uh, we're going to hit USB flash drive, and format. And we're going to say yes. If you've got anything on here, uh, you might want to copy it off beforehand because it's going to going to clear it off. So we're going to go ahead and format this drive. Exit out of this. Go back to the flash drive and unmount it. Uh, once it says unmount is complete, uh, now we can pull the drive out. Take it over to your computer. Go ahead and plug it in. And we're going to copy the uh, our files over to the um, flash drive. So once the download's done, it's going to be a zip. You're going to want to unzip that, and then you'll get a folder. In that folder, you'll have a 7610 104.dat. Uh, we're going to copy that and paste it into the root uh, 7610 folder uh, just right in here on your USB flash drive. Once that's done, take the USB flash drive back over to the radio, plug it into the front. Uh, if you're at the main menu, uh, at the home screen again, just hit menu. Go to set, tap on USB flash drive, and then firmware update. Uh, it's going to give you a bunch of uh, text regarding the firmware update. Uh, you'll have to scroll down and click yes. Tap on the firmware update. Uh, we're going to 104. And then you have to tap and hold yes. That's going to check the file. And it'll take probably about 30 seconds here. And then the update will be done. And that's it. You're ready to restart and you'll be good to go. That's it. That's all there is to it. Uh, before you unplug the flash drive, be sure to go back in the menu, set, USB flash drive, and scroll down to unmount. And you're good to go.